Logan, just me, this lovely, pretty face without my glasses because I ain't got my reading glasses on. So I've been on whatnot, buying some bargains. There we go, comics. Oh, go on there, do a bit of auctioning, buying some, some that I'll keep, some I might sell at my comic fair. And that, uh, so I've got some good old deals. Let's have a little look, shall we? Because I guess I've got some credit as well I used. When people join, they get £10. They spend £10, I then get £10 credit. Oh, they, yeah. So, I got this in a little bundle for about five, I think it was. So, we're going to start off. Well, I haven't seen this line before, but it's uh, Spider-Man, Chapter 1, Daredevil and Craven on the front. It's not bad. Then we've got, ooh, a line up here. One, two, three, four. Actually, we've got Supergirl. Mini series, one and four. I like that cover. Nice number one in the mini series. Not sure what year. It's the 70p comic from 94, I think it is. Then we've got number two. There we go. Really put some cool covers there. Number three, where she's inside out, some naughty bugger behind her. Very cool. And to complete it, at the series, Supergirl gets even with Superman, I think, as Lex Luthor. Could be. No. Yeah, I'd say so, because ginger hair. And then we've got <coughs> some Spider Man one. Let's just show me some Spider Man. That's it. So, we got. Spider-Man Chapter 1. Now, I like this cover. It's number 10, but it's kind of like the vet. Green Goblin on the front with evil smile. It's nice. Then you've got Chapter 1, number 11. What did it take? Kill a spider. Try a giant man. It's like, gives it away, don't it? Giant man! He's after him. Then you got number seven, Man Let's Be On Mind with Mysterio on the cover. Nice. Then again, chapter number eight, chapter one, Green Goblin, the Green Goliath, so Spidey. So you got Hulk and the Green Goblin. Cool in the middle. Not a bad cover. Then you got Spider Woman in the second issue. Which I've not seen Spider Woman that all very often. Not too bad. And you got this one. I don't know what it is. I really don't. But it's a very interesting cover. It's a variant. Virgin cover, sorry. So I need to look this up. Find out what it is. But I don't know. Then we've got Superman. Worlds of War. Future State. I love this cover. It just looks naughty. And then we've got Zorro. Black and White Noir. Number one. Simple but lovely cover. I like that cover. So that's that pile there. Right. Ooh, dead leg. And now let's have another look. Ooh. Here are pound each for these comics. These were these ones. So oh yeah, these are some old ones which I do love. These are from 1980 so old one spider-man and howard duck marvel team up look at the beauty on that cover that is lovely you know loving the old style and then we've got marvel superheroes in featuring incredible hulk number 57 it's not in great actually it's all right condition actually 
bit of wear and tear, but Joe you know what? For its age, from 1980, I think it is, or even younger. Can't see. I can't bother to open it. But hey ho, very nice. Then we got Spider Man, Doctor Strange, and Clear. Sorceress Pros Possessed. Again, this is from 1979. Very nice. Ooh, there we go. Then we've got. Another one from 1979, Spider-Man Guardians of the Galaxy. So, this is the Guardians of the Galaxy before the ones in the movie, before Rocket, Raccoon, come around and all that lot. So, you know, I like this, Guardians. And then you've got this Mo Naughty Moon Knight one. Look at the cover on that. That's lovely. I do like that. Okay. We've got another bundle here, one more bundle, so we've got, this is a reprint, authentic reprint of uh, the Brave and the Bold, number 28, first print of the Justice League, fighting the Starfish Geezer, and, uh, and there's a comic cover of this out as well, Funko Pop comic cover, that is very nice, and then we've got Powerless struggle Superman Man of Steel. Not one Superman Man of Steel. Not a bad one. And this is from like 1980, I think it is. 1992, sorry. My bad. But we got this one here, which I'm actually do like it. The X-Men's Archive Sketchbook. There you go. Very nice. But then you got another one. Fantastic Force number one. Not heard of them, but it's like a foil cover. So I think it's different. Then you got another one. We've got Dead of the Punisher Means and Ends. There we go. I think that's the Jackal down the bottom there. Again, we've got Crisis at Hand Part 1 or 2, Superman, the man of steel. That's, uh, he looks very evil. And that is from like uh, 87. Oh no, 92. We've got another one. This is, oh sugar, this is old. This is a 6P, a 6P comic. Not in its greatest condition, but Brave and the Bold. I'm not sure how old this is. But I think this is like uh, early 70s, maybe the 60s. They've got Batman and Black Canary there. As you can see, it's seen better days, but for a comic of that age, wow. Yeah, 20 cents. Then we've got Spider Man on Mars, Sensational Spider Man. Very nice cover. I likey, likey. Hunt for Xavier, X-Men, don't like. They've got another old one. This is a 5P comic. So you know it's old when it's 5P. Super Legion of Superheroes, one of my favourite groups. So that's quite an old, I'd say that 70s. Again, maybe earlier. I'm not too sure, I have to find out. This one I haven't seen before. It's Superboy in the comic book. Number one. Yeah. Interesting. This one. Megapixel back. <laughs> He's a little crafty bugger, that guy. I did have a Funko pop in, but Mr. Uh, pop Culture decided to melt the bugger and got damaged. So you got Weber Spider Man from 1981. And that is against, uh, I don't know who he is, Fist of Spark, I don't know, Fist of Spark, that's it, what an idiot I am. Then you've got Flash Gordon, the series, number three, from 88, 1988, I've got the whole series of this, if I remember correctly. 
So that's that bundle done. So let me know in the comments what you think. I do like the old styles. They float my boat more. So thank you again for watching me ramble on. And we'll see you next video. Bye.